Welcome back. This is John Locke, and today I'm answering a question. I saw this in a SEO group. I thought it was an interesting question, so I wanted to answer it. This is concerning local SEO, and the question goes, if a business has several locations set up in Google My Business, should each location link to a website's homepage or the location page for that city? I watched a video from Moz on how the local algorithm works. They experimented with this by linking Google My Business location pages to the home page rather than the location page and saw a positive impact in the search results, wondering why this might be and if it's worth trying. So what this person is describing is they're talking about if you have a Google My Business and let's say you have more than one location. Let's say, for example, that you had a location in Sacramento and Los Angeles, Las Vegas, uh, maybe San Francisco, Portland. So you have locations all over the place. And instead of for each of those locations in which you have a Google My Business, so instead of linking those to the location page, they're saying link it to the home page and it'll have a positive impact. And this person is asking why this would have a positive impact and if it's worth trying. So I have some thoughts on this. And uh, I'll explain it as, as I give my answer here. So explanation. If your location pages are strong landing pages, meaning you have a lot of information on that page, and you have a lot of info about what you do, like a home page, then it's probably worth linking to those separate landing pages. And if you only have basic location page data, like a map of the location, the hours of operation, address, the phone number, a contact form, and not much else, then I would link to the home page. And I will explain why in just a second. But the way that the algorithm works or at least the way that I observe it working, is it selects all possible pages that might fit a search query. So if you're searching for uh, Appliance Repair Sacramento, Appliance Repair uh, Portland, a a Appliance Repair San Francisco, Appliance Repair Los Angeles, uh, it's looking at all the pages that can fit in that query. And you might have more than one page on your website that could fit that query. And most of the time, as I say here, if the city and service are both mentioned on the location page and the home page, like in the title tag, like in the body of the, the page itself, th then those are both going to be considered for being ranked for that query. And to me, the big clue is what's already ranking higher for that page in that local query. So for example, I had one client that they were... Uh, trying to rank for a particular service that they offered. And uh, the way that we had their title tag at first is they had the city and the thing that they offered, their main offering. And that was part of the title tag for the contact page. And interestingly enough, that contact page was ranking higher than the home page. And because those words, the service and the city that they were in, were mentioned in the contact page and in the title tag, then that became a page that could fit that search query. And for whatever reason, Google said, let's push this instead of the home page or instead of the specific landing page. But we'll get into this in a second. But in most cases, if the city page and the home page from one site are both considered, the, the home page in most cases. Now, in most cases, not all cases, but in many cases, it's usually the one that Google chooses to show. And that's usually if the landing page for that city is less robust, meaning it's uh, got just this stuff, like I mentioned, like it has map, hours, address, phone number, contact form, not a whole lot else. It's not a robust page. So in that case, yeah, absolutely, the home page is going to, be a better choice. So that's this this Moz video. That's exactly what they're describing.
they're talking about the homepage being more robust. But there's a second reason why uh, Google would choose that. We'll talk about that in a second too. But uh, a lot's going to depend on whether the content of those two pages, meaning the title tag and the H1, like I just mentioned, uh, mentions the, the service in the city that you're trying to rank for, like local SEO. And Google can choose to rank both of those in the top two or three pages, because I've seen that happen before too, where it has uh, you know, not enough pages to pick just a single page from each site. And so it'll rank two pages from that site. So you might have your homepage and your city landing page or your location page, both ranking somewhere around the top 10 or the top 20. If it's, uh, if there aren't enough pages to really like just choose one of everything. So, I mean, that's another job in the eye to, uh, people who talk about keyword cannibalization because that, that kind of disproves it too. Uh, like I said, Google may choose to, to push the homepage, but it's the homepage is usually a better result because it's more robust and it's talking about all the services that that place might offer. And, and that is, is a big reason why. So if you're, you're saying, here's the URL for your Google My Business uh, location and you're choosing a location page and your location pages are a little bit thin and they're basically just a contact form and a contact info for, for that location, then most definitely Google might choose to uh, show the home page a little bit higher. Um, I don't know that it affects ranking like all that much, just changing the URL of the, the Google My Business, but you probably should have the URL of the Google My Business be the page that is already doing better or the page that you want to have rank. Uh, but if, as I've seen in some cases where the home page and the city landing page are like right next to each other, like maybe one is ranking at number 10 and uh, the home page and maybe the city page might be ranking at number 12 or something like that, then it's basically either one you could put in that Google My Business thing, and I don't think it's going to make a big difference. Um, so like I said, if it, there's low competition for that keyword, you could see both. So keyword cannibalization, BS. All right, over time, what I've noticed when you have this situation, Google will usually adjust to favor one over the other either the homepage or the city landing page in the search engine results. And the, re the other reason that, that I think we should talk about why Google chooses the homepage in a lot of cases to push that one, even if you have a, a, a service landing page, even if you have a city landing page, Google sometimes chooses the homepage because it is the page with the most links coming into it. The most page rank from other external websites is flowing into your homepage. And if your homepage has substantially more links coming into it, and it's a substantially um, stronger URL as far as um, links coming in or trust flow or URL rank or whatever you want to measure it by, then yeah, in most cases, Google is going to choose that. But if your location page or your city landing page is both robust for that city and that service and describes what you do in great detail as if you were making a page to be as robust as your home page, really going all out on making a landing page, uh, and you have a fair number of links coming into it, then that city landing page uh, is probably a good choice for uh, specific locations. Now, this all really depends. Now, like this person is asking this about this, and I have no idea like what their client site is. I have no idea the website that they're looking at, how many services they offer, if they have, you know, two or three basic services, or if they have 
you know, 10 or 12 different services. I don't know if it's a health site. I don't know if it's a home services site. I don't know if it's industrial or machinery or auto repair or banking. I have no idea. So it's all really going to depend. I, I think in some cases, like, you know, home services, auto repair, if you have a really robust landing page for that city and a specific service, then that might be a good choice. You know, but not if you have like 12 or, or 20 different services, like if it's a hospital or something like that, that might not be the best. Th then it would probably be best to just point them toward the homepage in your Google My Business. That's probably the best choice. I hope that sheds a little bit of clarity on this uh, question. If you, uh, <clears throat> anyway, I hope that sheds a little bit of clarity on this, my name's John Locke. My business is Lockdown Design and SEO. And I'm here every single day making videos on SEO. And thanks to all the, the new subscribers that have come on in the last couple months. We got like eight subscribers yesterday. So thank you so, so much for that. Really appreciate it. Uh, I'm Like I said, I'm here every day. Got a question? Leave it in the comments below. That's all for now. Until next time. Peace.